A new report out this morning discovered some leafy greens recently sold at supermarkets were contaminated with a potentially deadly bacteria. Consumer Report says it tested nearly 300 samples of fresh greens like lettuce, spinach, and kale. They say they found six of those samples tainted with listeria. CTM Consumer Investigative Correspondent Anna Werner is here. So Anna, where did Consumer Reports find these greens? So the six samples uh, were in various locations in about three states, uh, Connecticut, New Jersey, and New York in June. It's a sampling, but they did find listeria in pre-washed and the bagged greens that some people are told not to wash. Um, all the retailers are stressing that food sa safety, of course, is their top priority. Public health officials have not reported any illnesses or concerns following their own inspections. And Consumer Reports does note the study's not large enough to draw any conclusions about a specific brand or retailer. But this is intended to highlight the safety, the overall safety of the supermarket industry. Now, a trade association that represents retailers, wholesalers, and suppliers that sell products to grocery stores told us that the incidents uh, outlined in Consumer Reports remind us that the entire supply chain has a responsibility for safe food handling, and they do agree that you can make improvements in that. But the important thing to note is that listeria can be a very ser serious illness mm -hmm. um, for people who get it, and especially for those who are vulnerable. If you have a compromised immune system, um, if you uh, are older adults, infants and young children, and especially pregnant women. So, you know, I buy those packages of leafy greens that say triple wash, do not wash, because right. I'm lazy and I don't want to wash my and lettuce. And you think it's safe. And you think yeah. it's safe. Yeah. So if and you, what should you do to avoid getting sick? You know, so what's interesting about that is that actually the Food Association agrees and says that government regulators also will tell you not to wash the triple wash, that you're actually mm. exposing the greens and yourself to more contamination from things in your kitchen mm. when you re-wash triple washed greens. So even though they did find it in a couple of samples here, you know, it's hard to wash listeria off. You might wash something and it might still not come off. So I don't know the, what to do now, what you're saying. Yeah, we well, you know, th th and that's, I think, why Consumer Reports is talking about the overall safety of the food system for this needs to be uh, improved with whatever improvements they can make because you as a consumer are not necessarily going to know if the sample that you bought at the grocery store is contaminated by listeria. Yeah, it could be ice cream for dinner time. <laughs> you know what? I love that plan. Been and I've, that. I've been on that plan occasionally. <laughs> yes. I know that plan. Thank you very much, Anna.